you remember when you were a kid and you'd be in the car with your mom and you'd be like, Mom, like, there's a McDonald's over there. Can we have some McDonald's? And your mom would be like, do you have McDonald's money? And you just soak in your seat. I'm wearing pants, by the way. You just soak in your seat like, and then you'd ask her again, you say, please, mommy, please, please, please. So she'd be like, we have food at home. Oh, well, now that I'm an adult, I have a new, deeper understanding of we have food at home. But you know what? I'm also an adult, and you know what else we have at home? We have McDonald's at home. We have McDonald's at home. Mm -hmm. We have McDonald's at home. Okay, you're probably like, Ashley, what was that intro? What are we doing today? You're gonna find out. Okay, so pretty much, I woke up craving McDonald's breakfast. I don't fuck with McDonald's, but the breakfast, and pretty much, I want McDonald's, but I have groceries, so I'm like, oops. So I'm just like, why should, why should I spend money on McDonald's when I have groceries at home? So we're gonna make McDonald's at home. So here's my McDonald's hat. Welcome to McDonald's, what can I get for you today? I'm going to get an egg McMuffin, okay? Combo with hash browns and a fucking, I don't know what to drink with something. I also just got an iced coffee the other day, so I'm gonna empty this out, wash it, and fill my cup so I can really, really feel like I'm at McDonald's. Okay, so here we have our breakfast sausage. We only have sausage links, so I'm gonna just cut the casing and make it into a patty. Then we have English muffins, hash browns, cheddar fucking cheese. I don't know why I had to cuss. An egg and of course some butter and some salt and pepper. And you know what? Some chili flakes. So we're gonna make an egg McMuffin, okay? And it's gonna taste the exact same. It's gonna taste the same. So I made this video because I want to inspire others to eat the damn groceries that you bought at the store for a reason. You don't spend $40 at the grocery store every single other week or whatever you spend to go buy McDonald's because think about it this way. McDonald's combo is like what? Like $7 in Canada for an egg McMuffin, a drink and hash brown and stuff. But if you go to the store, $7 will literally get you a pack of fucking sausages hash browns, and English muffins. So now I'm gonna whisk that shit up. Yummy, just like McDonald's. Now I'm going to get my English muffin and put it in the toaster, but I'm not gonna toast it yet because we want it to be hot and fresh all at the same time. It's very weird when you grow up because you start to realize like all the things that your parents say <laughs> have meaning behind them they don't just say them because they want to be mean to you like it makes sense and sometimes it takes growing up for you to realize that like it took me moving out to realize a lot a lot of things and um when i moved out i became very grateful for all the things that like my parents did that i just didn't notice <laughs> and i had an easy life let's just say that Fun fact, actually no really, really sad fact. I didn't own a toaster until I moved out ever. I only ever had toaster ovens. And I never really knew the difference between the two, which is really fucking weird, but you know, cut the casing off. And like, now you got ground pork or whatever this is. I'm sure it's seasoned with something, but. What? <laughs> Why am I laughing? I'm so ridiculous. So now I just, I like to make it thin because it's gonna shrink in the pan. So I make it thin and um, try and spread it out so it doesn't shrivel up to a tiny little ball of sausage. I want it to be like, you know, like legit. Just like McDonald's. See? Woohoo! My hands are clean, don't worry. Don't worry. Okay, so, oh, spatula. So the oil's heating up right now. Okay, I'm putting the, what's it called? The hash brown on the pan. 
I don't know why it's not sizzling, but you know. And I'm putting the sausage on the pan as well. My stove takes forever to heat up. It's like one of the most frustrating things. I mean, at least I have a stove, right? Um, now I'll just give you some montage of me continuing to prep the ingredients. You're welcome. My hat is giving me such a headache, but like my boss doesn't let us take it off during our shifts because I think it's like a safety hazard if we don't have a hat on or something. So um, I have to leave it on for the whole shift, which is annoying, but I only have like eight hours left and I'm sure it's gonna fly by. So yeah. I asked for a Sprite, but they ran out. So they said I can have water instead because it's pretty much the same thing. I think, oh, TikTok. Can you see? Oh, yeah, you can. Wait, what am I supposed to do with it now? is some bullshit it keeps fuck it it doesn't do anything what am i supposed to what do i do <laughs> oh my god okay i think this is done oh my god guys my egg <laughs> ah. you know what you know what you know fucking what <laughs> Guys, I just got the job here. Still learning, I'm still new, so just bear with me, be patient with me, because McDonald's training is very intensive. I'm both a customer and an employee. Oh shit, I just dropped the fork. What is going on with me? I had too much caffeine. Okay, okay, now we prep. We're gonna put some butter on the English muffin, because that's what my manager taught me to do. And then we're gonna put the egg down. Amazing, do you see that? Beautiful, beautiful, wow, beautiful. Then we put the sausage, which I mean, you know, it's fine. Then we put the cheese. I don't have American cheese because that shit is disgusting. So, I use fresh cheddar. Then we put the thing on top. And then, we have our hash brown that goes along with it. And our drink. Do you see that? McDonald's who? I should be CEO of the company. I am CEO of the company. Okay, so we're gonna try it now. Because I'm Canadian, I eat ketchup with my hash brown. <laughs> okay. So let's see if this lives up to the McDonald's hype. Not bad for my first day on the job. There's a nice crisp. 
Oh my god, you guys need to hear the crunch. Hold on. Hold on. Mm hmm. Why would I go to McDonald's when there's food at home? There's not even food at home. There's McDonald's at home. Like I said. All in all, my experience working at McDonald's was pretty good. People complain. I think there's nothing wrong with it. I had a really good trainer. My manager is amazing. Um, I don't know what I would do without such an amazing staff behind me, supporting me, and showing me how to make this Egg McMuffin. This Sprite, that's not really Sprite, but is Sprite, is amazing. 10 out of 10. I'll be back for my shift tomorrow. Mm -hmm. I'm just fucking right.